In October 2024, the Philippine Army took a major step towards enhancing its defense capabilities by awarding LIG NEX-1 the contract for the AT-1K Raybolt anti-tank missile system. Set to be delivered by 2025, this acquisition marks a significant advancement in the Army's efforts to improve its coastal defense and counter-armored threats. The Raybolt missile system is designed for precision, with a range exceeding 2,000 meters and infrared guidance. It offers both direct and top-attack modes, with a hit probability above 90%. This advanced missile is capable of targeting everything from light armored vehicles to main battle tanks, and its tandem warhead is designed to defeat explosive reactive armor, making it a powerful weapon against fortified targets. What sets the Raybolt apart from older anti-tank systems is its fire-and-forget capability. Once launched, the missile autonomously guides itself to the target, allowing the operator to move on to the next target without needing to stay locked on. This capability is critical in modern warfare, where speed and flexibility are essential. The Philippine Army initially focused on lighter unguided anti-tank weapons, but after reassessing its needs, especially in light of global conflicts like the war in Ukraine, it shifted to more advanced, precision-guided systems. The Raybolt fits this new strategic direction perfectly, offering advanced guidance, greater lethality, and versatility. This project is funded by the Philippine Army's 2024 capital outlay budget, rather than the AFP modernization program, allowing for continuous and more frequent procurement of advanced systems. The acquisition includes five launchers and 10 missiles, totaling PHP 205.3 million, which also saved the Army PHP 3 million compared to the initial budget. The AT-1K Raybolt was chosen through a public bidding process. After a rigorous evaluation, it emerged as the best choice due to its cost-effectiveness and superior technical specifications. The missile system's performance in both land and coastal defense scenarios made it a perfect fit for the Philippine Army's evolving requirements. This acquisition is a test purchase, meaning the Army will evaluate the system's effectiveness in real-world conditions. If it performs well, additional acquisitions will follow, strengthening the Army's arsenal with more advanced technology. With the integration of the AT-1K Raybolt, the Philippine Army is not only modernizing its weapon systems but also improving its ability to respond to contemporary security challenges. This move represents a major shift towards more advanced, guided systems and sets the stage for continued modernization efforts. The Raybolt missile will enhance the country's coastal defense and anti-armor capabilities, making it a key component of the Army's strategic defense posture in the years to come. Thank you.